Sunderland manager Tony Mowbray praises Manchester United Loney Ahmad. Ahmad's performance against Wigan Athletic was the best Sunderland have seen of him, according to Black Cat's boss Tony Mowbray. The 20-year-old dropped down to the championship sides under 21 seconds on Monday night, and he played the full 90 minutes against Leeds United's youngsters. But in yesterday's championship clash, the Ivory Coast International came off the bench at halftime to help inspire the Black Cats to come from behind to beat the Latics 2 minus 1 at the Stadium of Light. Sunderland and Manchester United's number 16 has featured in the last seven championship matches, but he is yet to produce a goal or an assist for his lone side. Sunderland and Manchester United's number 16 has featured in the last seven championship matches, but he is yet to produce a goal or an assist for his lone side. Tony Mowbray praises Ahmad. The former Blackburn Rovers manager was full of praise for the former Atalanta Wonderkid when speaking after yesterday's championship clash. Mowbray said, I think that's the best we've seen of him. Listen, he's got flashes. He's a wonderful, wonderful footballer. On the training ground, he's so sharp quick and clever with the ball, he just has to add the end product for me. Every day I'm in his ear, so he knows, but the work ethic was good today, and the physicality he brought to the job was good and I was pleased for him. While Mowbray was happy with Ahmad's work and his ability to compete physically in one of the most demanding leagues around, he also once again reiterated that the four-time Ivory Coast international needs to improve his end product. Against Wigan, Ahmad had 27 touches and completed 16 of his attempted 19 passes to finish the game with 84% pass accuracy, according to Sofa score. He also won two ground duels, made two interceptions and registered a tackle. After producing his best performance in a Sunderland shirt, Ahmad will no doubt out be hoping he's done enough to earn his second start for the Black Cats when Sunderland travel to face Mowbray's former side Blackburn at Ude Park on Tuesday. In other news, Manchester United are reportedly interested in signing Inter Milan star Lotero Martinez in the January transfer window, with Eric Ten Hag still keen to bring in a striker. The Soraya side certainly won't be in any rush to part ways with the Argentine, meaning the Red Devils may need to think outside of the box with their offer. Over the summer, Ten Hag was granted plenty of spending power by United to rejig his changing room. However, with Cristiano Ronaldo still pleading to be sold, the former Ajax boss will certainly be in the market for reinforcements once more. Earlier this season, the higher powers at United suggested that the club had spent more than they anticipated over the summer, fueling speculation that Ten Hag will need to offload players before he is able to bring fresh faces to the club. La Gazzetta dello Sport reports that United have held talks with the agent of Inter Milan star Martinez recently in hope of securing his signature in January. Though the Red Devils boss could propose a swap deal to sign Martinez if he views the Argentina international as the ideal no-9. Express Sport looks at three players United could offer Inter for the versatile forward. If United are going to be in the market for a Ronaldo replacement, they could be tempted to make use of the 37-year-old in negotiations with Inter. The Portugal international Sean in the Soraya previously with Juventus, and a return to the league could see him find his form and prove that he is not reaching the end of his career. Ronaldo's wages will certainly be an issue but reports that United have not been approached due to financial issues could prompt the former Real Madrid star to lower his wage demands. The striker's contract expires at the end of the season meaning that United will lose him for free so a swap deal for a long-term replacement could prove smart. If you enjoyed the video make sure to drop a like and make sure to subscribe to Man United Hub to get all the latest updates. Get all the